guys, it's me again, and I'm here today with my latest Stitch Fix. <laughs> Just to introduce myself, my name's Fawn, and I'm here having fun, trying to figure lots of things out, and I'm hoping that you're going to come along and have fun with me. If I sound like somebody that you could have a laugh with, then please do subscribe, do give it a thumbs up, do comment to me, it all helps the channel. So let's get back to the box. I haven't opened it and I haven't peeked, which is just epic for me because I am a terrible peeker. So here we go. I did say that I was going to get in the habit of opening these things so that you guys didn't have to sit through it. And then I thought, well, it kind of looks like um, I am cheating. As usual, it has the instructions of what to do next on the lid here. It's really easy stitch fix. Um, everything's done through the post office. It's just super organized. As per usual, inside the box, I have a, mm, oh, you can exchange now. Now for a long time, we couldn't exchange, but we can now exchange if the fit is wrong, you know, if you want a different size. That's fabulous to know. It's a good step forward. And then in the envelope, you get your um, return mailer that you stick on the box because anything you don't want goes straight back in the box, straight back to the post office. My invoice and my style card. So I'm just gonna have a quick look and see if it's my usual. Um, yes, it is, it's Mel again. So here we go, let's see what Mel's got for me. I don't wanna look at the pictures because it sort of takes away from the excitement. And I can see in here, I have two bundles, I have a bundle of clothing. Ooh, some good colours in there. And I actually have a piece of jewellery. That's exciting. I don't think I've had jewellery from them before. Have I? No, I don't think I have. Break into it. Got to start with the jewellery, haven't you, girls? Okay, and what is... Oh, now that is pretty. Can you see that in the box? It's from Morvette. I've had some clothes from all that that have been really nice. Let's have a little look. Oh, is that attached? They've attached a, <laughs> a ribbon to it with the, the name and so on. But gosh, that's going to be right in the way. But it's a really pretty kind of green stone on a gold chain. That, oh, I like that. I do like that. So, okay. That's a good one, that is a good one. And then the bundle itself. I really like the colours in there, can you see? I really like the candles. <laughs> I really like the colours on the bundle. Start with a grey t-shirt by a company called Modstrom. I like the neck, can you see? I don't know, do they call that a boat neck or? I really do like that. It's in a large. It's called the Tansy Top in grey. I like that. That's, that's really nice. Very me. A bit worried. It might be a little bit tight though. Oh, here we go. Next up, love this colour. Can you see this colour? It's like a secret. Oh, it's a dress. Okay. This one is by Ghost. Oh, Ghost. I'll bet this is small. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, I bet this is really small on me. I've got a feeling this is going to be one of those, you know, can't keep your boobs in it job. But I really do like that. Um, buttons all the way through. It's like a, like a crepey fabric. I'll give it a go. And it could be a contender, actually, for exchanging if I do, because I do like it. Next is, ooh, aren't these cute? Look at these shorts. They're by Warehouse. Those, they are really, really cute. They've got pockets. So slightly pleated front, belt with it. Look at the colors. Look at the colors on that. Oh, now I do like those with something simple like a plain black t-shirt. I think they, that, they could look great. And then, oh, a pair of cream linen mix shorts, again by Warehouse, and a 16 pocket, oh no, fake pockets on the back, 
thank goodness. We know I don't like pockets on the back. Um, and sort of cargo pockets. Would it be cargo you'd call You know, pockets here. They're not pockets you can put your hands into. Belt. Really cute. I mean, <laughs> if the sizings work, this could be my first ever five for five because I literally like everything that has come out of the box. Well done, Mel. Okay, let's go and try them on. So I have the first piece on, which are these cream linen shorts. And I really like them. I went and got a t-shirt from my wardrobe, but I thought it would lend itself better to the cream. But probably how I would wear this, actually, to give it a punch of color. But I've got a few other things that would also work. It's got the tie belt. It's got these pockets on the front, which are actually working pockets, but I don't know what on earth I would put in them. Give you a quick view of the back. They're an elasticated, elasticated across the back, flat fronted on the front. Flat fronted on the front? You know, flat on the front. The only shame is they don't have pockets here, but I really do think they're nice. And as anyone who um, has watched more of my videos would know, I've been having some shorts problems just lately. I do love shorts. But I had a quick look in the mirror and I thought they were nice. Um, yeah, only things missing are side pockets, but you've got some of you may recognise this black t-shirt. I got this in my last Citrix box. Yes, I kept it in the end, even though I've got lots of black tops. I realised I didn't have anything that was quite as fitted as this. And I thought it worked really, oh, I've done that already. I hate, am I the only person in the world that hates saggy belts and this is a saggy belt and what I usually end up doing is this if I even bother with the belt so I'll, I'll just do my usual sort of tie it off to one side <laughs> but aren't they cute they're fuller in the you know the legs and they're more flowing they're almost sort of skirt like in some ways they don't have elastication in them at all so it's a true you know you, it has to fit and they do the pattern is just adorable. I mean, they really would work with loads and loads of things. Um, they have pockets. Oh, I love a pocket. They're a nice length. Um, you know, I suppose they could have been a little bit shorter, but I actually like the fact that they're quite long. I feel I could wear these anywhere. Yeah. So, yeah, I like them. Well, I think I've got my failure. I really like it. I like the neckline, although my bra keeps picking out. I like the neckline. I like the colour. I like grey. But it is incredibly tight in the body. It's not kind. Um, I will give you a quick glimpse of all this magnificence. <laughs> It just isn't working. I don't know whether we need to go up a size. I can't remember what size this is. I would I would be tempted to try it in a bigger size and see if that's gonna be, but it is, well, I might even need to, I need to go up two sizes because it just is so incredibly close fitting here. I mean, it's not too bad there, which is where I was, I'm always most worried. But here, goodness gracious. So, I don't think it's going to be five for five unless as I say I like everything else so much that I exchange this I'm being brave just for you <laughs> as you can see we have a major problem here my bosoms are barely in the cups of this dress so I come in a bit you can see what I'm talking about it has these cup uh, shapes and I am barely in it and every single button down to sort of where does it stop gaping well about there so there down fits fine room you know it's got a nice little bit of flow to it it is knee length with a split the sleeves are lovely not too tight little bit of movement there and I actually like the shape the shape of the neckline I think is lovely, but again, I'm having a boob problem. So in this dress, I would totally have to size up at least one 
maybe two sizes to to get the bazooms in. I think it's something I'm definitely have to mention to my stylist, both at Stitch Fix and at Lakiro, that if something has no give in it, no stretch in it, that I am quite well. I mean, they've got my measurements, so they should know, but I am well endowed. <laughs> Once again, I'm patting and stroking. Oh. Um, while I've got this on with a terrible neckline, let's just go over here and get the necklace. But I still haven't managed to take that daft string off. They must be worried. Maybe other people are wearing things and they're not. But I think it'll go really beautifully with this dress. Yes, I got it. Okay. So, there's the neck. Oh my gosh, I think that's absolutely gorgeous that is so so pretty it's delicate you know the chain is very delicate but the stone is big enough that you know you can see it sometimes these dainty ones they're almost like well why are you bothering i really do like that oh okay do i ask for them in a bigger size and do a five for five hmm oh Let's do a recap. So, what did my stylist say? Let's have a little look. Hello Fawn, welcome back for another fix. I hope you're enjoying your week so far. I started today off with a couple of shorts for you to give a go. I don't have a tropical print cotton style, but I sent you this floral alternative by Warehouse that is a great summery style. I did ask if they had any shorts that were cotton and tropical. I'd like to try them because, <laughs> as I say, I've got rid of quite a few pairs of shorts just lately. As you've been enjoying the neutral shades I've sent you, I also thought you should give these utility beige shorts, or utility, I suppose they're utility pockets, aren't they? I was struggling for what to call them. A go, made from cotton and linen blend, teeny shorts with your tees like this wardrobe essential style, grey piece tucked in, jazz up your outfits with the gold plated and natural stone necklace included. It's green aventurine is the stone. Oh, that's nice to know. Green aventurine is known as the stone of opportunity, thought to be the luckiest of all crystals. It'll also go nicely with the simply elegant ghost dress I chose for you. Take care, Mel. Did a marvellous job, Mel. We've just got to figure out the boob sizing. So let's have a look at some prices and see if I can make a decision. As you can tell, I'm still wearing the necklace. I'm really keen. Oh, well, okay, straight away. The necklace is staying. It's by Morvette. Asta Precious Stone Necklace in Green, it's £22. I think it's worth every penny of £22 and it will be staying and I will be able to take off this ridiculous thing. <laughs> okay, the dress by Ghost, the green dress, it's called the Leona dress and it's £89. Mm. I'm not sure. I, I, 89 is a lot for a very summery dress when we are moving towards the end of summer now. Do I know that I would pull for it next year? I'm not sure. Uh, this is it in a large. I'd need at least an extra large for it to fit comfortably, maybe even an extra extra in this. So I think it's gonna have to be a no and that's gonna stop me from having a five for five. I can't wait to have a five for five, but <laughs> although my, <laughs> my wallet can wait. So, Pretty as it is, you know, the colour really got me. I do love these sort of minty colours. Pretty as it is, this one is going back. So, back in the box. Now that means I can't get the discount. Next up is the Modstrom Tansy Top. Grey, large, 25 99 Now I liked it. And if the dress had been perfect, I or you know, worthwhile, I would have asked for this in a bigger size. But again, I might need to go two sizes because that was just so tight around my middle. So it's going to go, I mean, 25 99 for a t-shirt. I suppose it's lovely quality, so I suppose it's not a bad price, but it's not good enough when it's too small. But the shorts, where do we stand with the shorts? Okay, the daisy belted shorts, which I just thought was so cute. And as I say, I could see myself dressing these up. So the Daisy Belted Shorts in a 16, 32 pounds. I liked them. I, I really like these. I haven't seen anything like them before. They're a bit outrageous, they're a bit of fun. I think I can really make them work, although I will probably ditch the belt. So I think they're gonna stay. And last but not least is the Utility Tie Front Short. 
again in a 16, they're calling the colour beige, £29. Um, yeah, I mean, what's not to like? I think they'll really work. I think I'll get quite a lot of wear out of them. So, three out of five, that is not bad. And really, it's only sizing issues that stop this from maybe being a five out of five. So the whole, entire box, if I've kept everything, adds up to £197.99. The buy all discount is 20%, which is £39.60. And with the £10 styling charge also deducted, if I'd kept the whole lot, it would have been £148.39. A piece of jewellery, two shorts, a t-shirt and a dress, which I, I hear people saying stitch fit shit. <laughs> I hear people saying stitch fit. I said it again, stitch fit. Stitch fix is expensive, but they are very good quality. Um, and they are finding things that I am not finding in shops. So I think that's still a very good price. I'm just a little bit disappointed that it's not a full five for five. You did so well, so close. Anyway, that was me. That was my stitch fix. Uh, I've been fawn and I'm out of here. Bye.